today we are going to discuss about the topic measurement to take an accurate measurement of any kinds of substances we need standard quantity so simply measurement means it is the process of comparing an unknown quantity with a standard quantity so for the measurement of any physical quantities we use different methods and devices we need some of the devices like scale to measure the length a watch to measure time and a beam balance with a standard weight to measure the mass also there we have thermometer to measure the temperature and other so on so children may you are confused with the terms physical quantity so physical quantity men actually the things which we can measure for example here mass length time temperature weight etc and the things which we cannot measure are not taken as the physical quantity just like the feelings like happiness sadness anger joy excitement and so on so children in conclusion we can say that measurement is comparison of unknown physical quantity with known standard quantity for example here the length of copy is unknown physical quantity but here the scales and the ruler that is standard quantity so we compare it and the process is called the measurement similarly when we measure the body temperature the body temperature is unknown physical quantity and the thermometer which we are using that is the standard measuring device so when we compare these two things together then the process is known as the measurement measurement is much more important in daily life we use measurement for various purposes in our daily life so some of the importance are listed here number one measurement is useful for the exchange of goods it is important for conducting scientific experiments it is important for global understanding of the quantity of substance goods etc it is useful to measure raw materials in industries it is important for making and preparing food it is useful to buy and sell things at last here are some assignment for your knowledge test thank you